Hey guys, Huawei has made EMUI 10 available for most users. If you haven't received it just yet, just keep checking. You might be able to download it tomorrow. Anyway, back to the update. What has changed? We all love dark mode, or at least our batteries do. It's now system wide and I'm definitely turning that on. We also refreshed menu, which seems to be a little bit more slick and settings seems to be in the more obvious locations. We've refreshed menu, comes a new UI. Weirdly, Huawei has not copied Google Pixel and Android 10 vanilla theme. Rather, they went out and designed their own, which is supposed to look like magazine, bold and squarish. In my opinion, this is a step back. It kind of looks dated, but maybe it's just something that I need to get used to with time. Huawei has also reworked the notification bar. Here, they've made it look more modern, and it's now a two swipe bar. What I mean by that is it's a bit more convenient for one handed use where you do a first swipe to get the initial short amount of settings and you swipe again to get the full settings. I do miss the ability to quickly see what network or Bluetooth device I'm connected to. Not a deal breaker, but yet again, I think it's a step back. With the new UI, the phone does feel a bit more snappy. I'm not sure if they just did a tweak in the software or is it the new style of animations. Talking about snappy. The camera app is now smoother when changing between lenses. But at the same time, you need to click and drag to do the zoom rather than looping in one spot to click between different cameras. I personally preferred it the old way, but yet again, I just, I just need to get used to it. On the other hand, I absolutely love the new Master AI toggle on the front of the photo app. When it's misbehaving, I can quickly turn it off and still get my picture rather than going through the settings like a crazy person. It seems Huawei has listened to user feedback and introduced a little flashy note every time you move between photo, video or other modes. That's definitely saved a lot of hassle. Let's cover the most important change in the update. It's an upgrade and a split between privacy and security. This Android 10 feature is baked into EMUI 10. We call it feature, but it should have really been an essential part of all phones since day one. Now you're able to see all your app permissions and also allow access, let's say, location only when the app is open. Hopefully this will minimize the amount of apps snooping on you unknowingly. It's kind of ironic, Huawei introducing privacy apps? While I don't necessarily agree with the design choices that Huawei has made on this phone, I may have to install a theme in the near future. At the same time, I do appreciate the security updates and the snappiness of the device as it is right now. I hope you enjoyed that. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe to show your support, and we'll see you in the next one.